Shalom, shalom. It's TJ here. Uh, many of you probably haven't seen me in a long time. I'm not dead. I'm not in jail. <clears throat> Some might say that I should be. Depends on who you talk to. Uh, but I'm here. I'm alive. Uh, not hiding. Uh, just very disappointed in, uh, in people. I guess I kind of help people uh, to a higher standard. Um, and I probably shouldn't have done that. Probably shouldn't have done that uh, with certain folks. And um, uh, many of you probably believe and think that I've uh, left Jesus, uh, left the Lord, ran off and joined a cult. <clears throat> Depends on what story you listen to. Uh, but that's not the truth. Um, the truth is that I've always been seeking Jesus. Always have been trying to get closer to him. Uh, always have been trying to do the right things in life. And uh, it doesn't always, doesn't always pay off sometimes in the way that you would hope. But <clears throat> uh, I'm here. I'm probably going to, you know, put some more stuff out. Uh, I'm not into the business of trying to uh, blast people or anything like that, but uh, I'm disappointed in a lot of folks. Um, some people could look probably look me in my face and say, TJ, I'm disappointed in you, not even knowing the full truth of the matter. Because um, whatever story is out there about me, it's only the partial truth. The full entirety of the story is not out. Uh, I haven't had a psychotic break. Uh, <laughs> that's one thing that's out there. I haven't uh, abused anybody. Um, haven't done any of that stuff. But some of you may hear that. Uh, a, lot, a lot of people that hear that uh, are people who I've spent time with. Had in my home, eating meals with. Nobody called. Nobody said, hey. This is what I'm hearing, man. Is this true? Folks don't do that anymore, I guess. I don't know. And so they hear a story, they run off with it, and they let it settle in their spirit and in their heart, and they believe that. Um, you know, meanwhile, I'm here. I've reached out uh, to many folks. Um, folks tell me I can't help you. Some don't respond. Um there's a time I used to never have any issues getting in contact with anybody or having any issues uh, hanging out with anybody. But now, uh, can't get phone calls back, no responses, um, partial truths, fabricated stories out there. Um, and it's okay. It's okay. Uh, it, it doesn't bother me uh, nearly as much as um, maybe one would hope, but I, I just got to stand and just hang tight because uh, the truth always comes out. Um, well, I'm here, I'm alive, I'm well, uh, and the uh, reality of the matter is I have not seen my family since January 20th. Um, more specifically, my children uh, have not held them, have not talked to them. Um, I don't even know if they are any bigger or small. I mean, I don't know. I haven't seen them, though. But I'm here. I'm alive. Uh, I've always taken care of my family. Uh, always made that a priority to make sure my kids were uh, taken care of, fed, well-clothed. Uh, shelter, uh, loved on, uh, same thing for my wife, but, <clears throat> uh, maybe that, that stuff doesn't mean anything anymore, I don't know, I don't know, you tell me, tell me what you think, tell me what you think, um, but, like I said, I'm here, not running, not hiding, uh, just living, and, uh, you know, maybe I'll see them again, Maybe I won't. It's really not my call. 
really not my call at all. So um, there's a lot of stories out there. There's a lot of things. Oh, he just a part of straight way. So he, he joined the cult. Uh, the biggest problem I, I would say is uh, I discovered who who I am and found what I what I've been looking for this whole time. And I, I guess that's scary to people. So, but that's their problem, not mine. But I'm here, strong, uh, still alive, still well. Shalom, shalom.